So, let's talk about humanoid robots stealing your job, but watch until the end because you do not want to miss how you can not only survive in this robot revolution, but thrive. Look, we all need to work. It's how we pay the bills, put food on the table, maybe even snag that sweet vacation we've been dreaming about. But what if your job was suddenly stolen by a machine? A machine that doesn't need sleep, doesn't ask for a raise, and never takes a day off? Picture this. You walk into work one day and bam, everything's changed. You're out of a job, replaced by a robot that never gets tired, never complains, and works for peanuts. Sounds crazy, right? But it's already happening in some industries, and it's spreading fast. But here's the twist. While robots are taking some jobs, they're actually creating new ones. Think about it. Someone needs to build those robots, program them, and fix them when they break down. The job market is changing, not disappearing. It's evolving, just like it always has. Therefore, we need to adapt. We need to learn new skills, embrace technology, and be ready for the jobs of the future. It's not about fighting the robots. It's about working with them. It's about understanding how this technology can empower us, make us more efficient, and help us solve problems we couldn't solve before. Manufacturing was the first to feel the robot takeover. Those repetitive, physically demanding jobs, perfect for robots. But this has pushed manufacturers to upskill their workforce. Now, humans are supervising the robots, troubleshooting problems, and ensuring quality control. And now, with humanoid robots entering the scene, things are getting even more interesting. These aren't your typical industrial robots. They're designed to work in spaces built for humans, using the same tools and equipment. They can adapt and learn quickly. This means robots can collaborate with human workers, taking on the heavy lifting and dangerous tasks, while humans focus on problem solving and creativity. But this also raises some concerns. Could these advanced robots eventually replace human workers altogether? Or will they become valuable partners, helping us to be more productive and efficient? It's a question we need to consider carefully. Truck drivers, taxi drivers, delivery people, they're all feeling the heat. Self-driving vehicles and automated logistics are changing the game. But think about the possibilities. Fewer accidents, less traffic congestion, and faster deliveries. The challenge? Finding new roles for those displaced workers and ensuring that the benefits of this technology are shared by everyone, not just a select few. Robots are revolutionizing healthcare. They can perform incredibly precise surgeries, monitor patients 24-7, and even help with rehabilitation. This means better outcomes for patients and less strain on healthcare workers. But will they replace the human touch, the empathy and compassion that are so vital in healthcare? It's a delicate balance we need to strike. Now, this is where things get really interesting. Think of this robot revolution like a wave. You can either try to stand your ground and get knocked over, or you can learn to surf and ride that wave to new opportunities. It's about adapting, evolving, and finding new ways to thrive in a changing world. Get this. The robotics industry is expected to be worth over $200 billion by the end of 2025. That's huge. And does it mean tons of new jobs in robotics design, engineering, and maintenance? But, here's the big question. Will these new jobs be enough to offset the jobs lost to automation? But hey, your secret weapon is to become a polymath. Now you might be wondering, what the heck is a polymath? Basically, it's someone who knows a lot about a lot of different things, a jack of all trades. Think Leonardo da Vinci, artist, scientist, inventor, the whole shebang, or Marie Curie, who rocked both physics and chemistry. In a world where AI is taking over all those specialized tasks, being able to connect the dots between different areas is gonna be a superpower. Why is being a polymath such a big deal in 2025 and beyond? Polymaths are awesome at problem solving because they can pull from all sorts of knowledge and perspectives. They're also 
innovation machines, connecting ideas that seem totally unrelated to come up with something new. Plus, they're adaptable and can learn new stuff super fast, which is key when the world is changing so quickly. Oh, and they make great leaders because they can talk to and work with all kinds of people. So, how do you become a polymath in 2025? Never stop learning and exploring new stuff and mix it up. Don't just stick to one thing. Take different online courses, attending workshops, or even going back to school. Get those basics down pat and master critical thinking, communication, and problem solving. Those are your foundations. Becoming a polymath is a journey, not a destination. It's about constantly leveling up your knowledge, skills, and perspectives to thrive in a world that's always changing. Even if your job is relatively safe, upskilling and enhancing your existing skills is essential. This also could involve learning new software, getting certifications. Focus on skills that are less susceptible to automation, such as critical thinking, problem solving, creativity, communication, and emotional intelligence. These are the skills that will set you apart in the future job market. Now, let's talk about some future-proof jobs that are less likely to be automated and are expected to be in high demand in the coming years. As the population ages, the demand for healthcare professionals will continue to grow. This includes doctors, nurses, therapists, and other healthcare providers. Educators will always be needed to guide and inspire future generations. This includes teachers, professors, curriculum developers, and educational technology specialists. The tech industry will continue to boom, creating numerous opportunities for AI ethicists, data scientists, cybersecurity analysts, and AI researchers. As the world transitions to cleaner energy sources, jobs in renewable energy will be in high demand. This includes solar panel installers, wind turbine technicians, and energy efficiency consultants. Human creativity will always be valued, creating opportunities for artists, designers, writers, musicians, and other creative professionals. The future of work is full of possibilities. By embracing lifelong learning and developing in-demand skills, you can navigate the changing landscape and thrive in the age of automation. The robots are here to stay, but that doesn't mean the end of work for humans. It's a call to action, a call to adapt, to learn, to innovate. But how do we do that? How do we survive this robot revolution? The key is to focus on what makes us human, our creativity, our critical thinking skills, our emotional intelligence. These are the things robots can't replicate, at least not yet. We need to embrace lifelong learning, develop new skills, and find ways to collaborate with robots, not compete against them. A 2022 study by Akshamoglu, Restrepo, Otter, and Hazel, published in Econometrica, titled artificial intelligence and jobs. Evidence from online vacancies provides valuable insights into how we can navigate the changing landscape of work. This study analyzed millions of online job postings to understand how AI is affecting the demand for different skills. They found that while AI is automating some tasks, it's also creating new opportunities that require uniquely human skills. Here are some of their key takeaways. AI is complementing, not just replacing, human labor. While some jobs are being automated, AI is also creating new tasks and roles that require human skills like critical thinking, creativity, and complex problem solving. Social skills are becoming increasingly important. The demand for social skills like communication, teamwork, and empathy is growing as AI takes over more routine tasks. Technological literacy is essential. Workers who can understand and work with AI technologies will be in high demand. This includes skills like data analysis and AI research. To thrive in this new world of work, we need to embrace lifelong learning, focus on human-centered skills, become tech-savvy, and promote responsible AI development. 
Ensure that AI is developed and used in a way that benefits all of society, not just a select few. This isn't about fearing the future. It's about shaping it. It's about using technology to create a better world for everyone. A world where humans and robots work together to solve our biggest challenge future together, smarter and stronger than ever before. And hey, speaking of the future, are you ready to see some jaw-dropping robots that will blow your mind? Check out the next video on the screen to watch the latest and greatest in robotics at CES 2025, including some incredibly realistic humanoid robots that you have to see to believe.